Hey collectors, Diego here. Thank you for joining another video here on the Sports Cars Detour. We're going back to Triple B Collectibles. Bergie over there in Minnesota. He's running his shop and he's also doing group breaks on TripleBCollectibles.com. You can go ahead and check them out. Uh, I My break results are from uh, Upper Deck MVP. Like I said in my Flyers video, I bought nine teams. So this is the second team down. Um, what I got in this break for the St. Louis Blues. Bought into the break, and I got the St. Louis Blues in this one. And these are my returns. Basically, we're going to start off with the base cards, which is Braden Shen. We got... Tory Krug, goalie card, Jordan Bingington, we have David Perron, Mike Hoffman, Justin Falk, and Vladimir Tarasenko. Those were the base cards for this one. Then the base cards also had usually have rookies but i didn't get any for the st louis blues but we move on to what we i got for ice battles which is basically the same cards just uh different stuff on the back basically like rankings for each one of the their um, skills and i got the shen and krug bingington Ron Hoffman and Justin Falk. I believe I'm missing a Tarasenko. So that's pretty cool. There's also a blue variation, which I got two of. I got two of the blue variations of Ryan O'Reilly. Which until this video, I didn't know it was blue. I thought it was just another one of the green ones, but that's a variation of the card. Then I got another variation of Ryan O'Reilly in the silver, um, the silver script. Ryan O'Reilly. Then I got the MVP watch of Ryan O'Reilly. <laughs> well, actually, I should put him on this side. But I'm going to cover them up in a second because I got a Vladimir Tarasenko also on that MVP watch variation of the MVP cards. thought they were pretty cool. Uh, for my mascot, I got Louie, the polar bear. This rare, this rare blue furred saxophone player f feels most at home with fellow blues fans. So that is the mascot card that MVP has this year. And then my final card is my probably my hit. It's an MVP watch die cut gold gold and red variation, number to 250. And that is a Braden Shen. Really nice looking card there. So MVP is a pretty um, inexpensive product, and it, it definitely good for making sets and stuff like that. And that's what I plan to do. Like I got into the break, bought the nine teams. Now that I have like a lot of the cards, what I'll do is I'll find some boxes to kind of fill in the other teams, and I might join. I think Bergie said that he might do another box break. So I might buy teams that I didn't buy before and get their base cards and go ahead and start building the set like I did last year. So that is my break results for the St. Louis Blues in the break and upper deck MVP break of with Triple B Collectibles with over there in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Um, 
yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else to say from there. Thanks for watching. Until next time. 